Hello and welcome to the Archie Luxury channel. Today I'd like to discuss something really, really crazy and you may not believe it's really true. No, this is not an April Fool's prank. Archie Luxury sells off his watch collection. That's right, Archie Luxury sells off his watch collection. Now before you all um, tell me this is crazy, I, I, I'm actually going to keep a few pieces. And uh, what's basically happened is, I just got my insurance renewal, and uh, it's about the, the three and a half thousand dollar mark. And uh, I've got, uh, I just had uh, my bank safety deposit fees came in, that's another two hundred dollars. And um, I'm just looking at my entire collection, I've got pieces in the bank, uh, I've got two pieces at home, and I'm saying to myself, what the fuck, Archie? I've got, I'm just looking at my, um, my stock listing, and I've got over a hundred thousand dollars, over a hundred thousand dollars worth of luxury items sitting in either a bank safe, um, or if I'm lucky enough to wear a piece. And uh, I'm just thinking to myself, hey, this is crazy. So I'm, I'm gonna, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna keep. I'm going to keep two pieces for myself at the moment. I've decided to keep the Calatrava Patek and the Jaeger La Coltra Grand Reverso Date. And I'm flicking the rest. Now, I've already listed on eBay. Uh, I've listed, you can have a look on eBay. If you search for Audemars Piguet uh, dress watch, it'll come up. There's an Audemars Piguet Ultra Slim. And uh, I've listed this piece at I started the auction off at eleven ninety nine, one thousand one hundred and ninety nine dollars, under twelve hundred bucks for an Audemars Piguet Ultra Slim dress watch, and it's it's really it's not going up much at the moment. It's a, it's about twelve hundred and twenty five bucks. So you know if you if you're interested in in picking up a watch from Archie, have a uh, a look on eBay there. I've also listed my full size steel Cartier. Panther watch. That's a complete box papers uh, piece. It's a really nice, good full size bracelet on that. And I've started that auction at fourteen fifty, one thousand four hundred and fifty. And uh, there's no bids at the moment. So if you're interested in um, the Audemars Piguet or the um, the uh, the Cartier Panther, go and have a look on eBay. And uh, my username is Archie Luxury 09. And uh, yeah, yeah, certainly uh, have a bid there. Um, and uh, I'm I'm happy to consider all offers. If someone's got an offer, you can you can you can email me directly, or you can just bid. Use the auction process. I'm also I'm selling a few other pieces off. I've um, I've had a talk to the wife, and the wife feels the same way. She said, look, she wants to keep the Patek. The Patek 24, which I can certainly understand, that's a gorgeous piece. But uh, I've already, I've already got for sale the ladies' steel date just with white gold bezel. Uh, that's that's a good, very nice piece. That's been fully overhauled, fully serviced, um, and professionally polished. That's in great great condition, and I've added uh, some spare links into that piece there. So that's a great piece. And I've also, uh, my wife said, look, just get rid of the Cartiers. They've been in the bank for the last, one of them's been there for about five years. It's been in the bank safety deposit box. It hasn't moved. And uh, that's the Cartier Diablo, which is a cracker of a piece. All original, box, everything. Beautiful piece. And, um, you know, if, if you're interested, I, I'd certainly consider uh, offers there. I mean, for the, for, the, for, the, uh, for the Diablo, look, I'd take high twos. For the so high two thousands, um, uh, for the uh, the Banwa, I'd, I'd 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 be looking at the same, you know, high high twos. So if if you if you do like those pieces and you want to buy something from Archie Luxury, uh, just shoot me an email and I, I'm happy to um to see if we can nut out a deal. And uh, look, I'm just you know I, I I am keeping my Patek Philippe Calatrava. My wife's keeping her Patek Twenty Four. And I'm also going to keep the Jaeger La Coltra Reverso Grand Date. But I'm clearing out everything else. I've also given my Omega Speedmaster Man on the Moon to an auction house. And uh, if you are interested in that, email me and I'll, I'll see if I can nut a deal out for you there. 
and I've also given the auction house my Rolex Explorer 2. Now you might say, why the hell Archie are you doing this? You've got a beautiful little collection. Uh, why would you do this? And, and, and there's a couple reasons. Number one, I sold my Vacher and Constantine dress watch and I fucked the dynamics on my collection. The next reason is I'm just saying to myself, you know, I've got over a hundred thousand dollars. That's what I paid over, and I bought my thing secondhand, and I look for value. I've put over a hundred thousand dollars into luxury goods, and um, all I've got to show for it is a three and a half thousand dollar insurance bill, two hundred dollar bank safety deposit charge, and and I'm just thinking to myself, you know. You know, do I really, I mean, I mean, how many watches can I wear? I'm not even wearing my Patek or my Reverso because I'm, I'm old, I'm rotating pieces. I'm thinking, this is fucked. Archie, just, just keep your Patek, keep your Jager, sell the rest of the watches. And, and for my wife, she's a nurse. She's not even allowed to wear a watch because she, she, um, she's in a section where they, they look after babies and uh, she can't even wear a watch. So she, she only wears the uh, one watch on weekends if we're going out so what's the point of all this these these pieces so look if you're after a bargain any pieces that you really like come to me i'm in australia i'm an honest trader and I, i'm happy to uh see if we can cut a deal i'm archie luxury and thanks for listening to this announcement <laughs>